Hey, MBK, I'm Justin Miller. And I'm Miles Matthews. And we're here today to talk to you about a few events that have recently been buzzing around our society. As some of you may know, recently an unmanned NASA contracted anti-terrorist rocket was set off to launch off of the coast of Virginia. The rocket was carrying 5,000 pounds of equipment meant for the International Space Station. Unfortunately, seconds after the rocket took flight, it exploded into a burst of flame, smoke, and debris. No one was injured from this accident. However, evidence and first-hand accounts state that the flight's termination system was employed. They engaged the self-destruct system because the operators feared the rocket wouldn't make it to orbit and didn't want to risk an explosion over a populated area. In other news, it has been believed that the Russian government has made attempts on the cybersecurity of the White House and the U.S. as a whole. Although the evidence is circumstantial, the virus was written in Russian and developed during working hours consistent with those in Moscow. There is no hard evidence because the hackers were able to stay anonymous by bouncing their computer signals around the world. However, Russia has still been credited for hacking J.P. Morgan and attacking several oil and gas companies. Also, Russian hackers have been blamed for slipping a digital bomb into the U.S. stock market, one that had the potential to incapacitate the stock market computers and impair the U.S. economy. That's all we have for this segment around the world. Be sure to tune in next time. Now back to you, D.A. and Nia.